Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm Bill. We're in the Advanced Player's Guide today. Uh, we are continuing the Archetype class build for uh, Druids. We are now on Animal Shamans. And so this video is going to be on the Bear Shaman. So without further ado, we're going to read in to see what you would get if you wanted to play a Bear Shaman. And if or what abilities you would lose from the regular druid abilities. Bear Shaman. A shaman with this focus calls upon the mighty bear, titan of the woodlands and mountains, a paragon of strength and ferocity, and yet also a quiet protector rich in wisdom. Nature Bond. A bear shaman who chooses an animal companion must select a bear. If choosing a domain, the bear shaman must choose from the Animal, Earth, Protection, and Strength Domains. Wild Empathy. A Bear Shaman can use Wild Empathy with Bears and Wolverines as a full round action with a plus four bonus. Totem Transformation. At second level, a Bear Shaman may adopt the aspect of the bear while retaining her normal form. She gains one of the following bonuses. Movement plus 10 Enhancement Bonus to Land Speed. Uh, plus four Racial Bonus on Swim Checks. Senses. Low light vision and scent. Toughness. Plus two natural armor bonus to AC and the endurance feat. Four natural weapons. A bite doing 1d6 and two claws for 1d4 for a medium shaman. Plus two combat uh, attack modifiers for uh, grapple checks. While using totem transformation, the bear shaman may speak normally and can cast speak with animals, mammals only, at will. Using this ability is a standard action at second level, a move action at seventh level, and a swift action at twelfth level. The bear shaman can use this ability for a number of minutes per day equal to her druid level. These minutes do not need to be consecutive, but they must be used in one minute increments. This is a polymorph effect and cannot be used while the druid is using another polymorph effect, such as Wild Shape. Totemic Summons. At fifth level, the bear shaman may cast Summon Nature's Ally as a standard action when summoning bears, and summon bears gain temporary hit points equal to her druid level. She can apply the Young Template to any bear to reduce the level of the summoning spell required by one. She can also increase the level of the summoning required by one in order to apply either the Advanced or Giant Template, or increase it by two to apply both the Advanced and Giant Template. This ability replaces 8,000 faces. Wild Shape. At sixth level, the Bear Shaman's Wild Shape ability uh, functions at her druid level minus two. If she takes on the form of a bear, she instead uses her druid level plus two. Bonus feat. At ninth level and every four levels thereafter, the bear shaman gains one of the following bonus feats. Die hard, endurance, great fortitude, improved great fortitude, toughness. She must meet the prerequisites for these feats this ability replaces Venom immunity. Well, reading that, it makes me want to play a bear shaman. It would be a lot of fun uh, leaning into all that and enjoying the uh, bears re wreaking havoc and being able to summon bears that are younger, bigger, stronger, that wide gamut that it gives you access to. What do you all think of the Bear Shaman? Put them in the comments below. Until we all game again, guys.